Hello students, welcome back to our channel ACL Learning with Divya. Students, in today's class, let us understand about word problems on time. Here is the question. Anitya plays for 1 hour 30 minutes in the morning and 45 minutes in the evening. So, for how long hours does Aditya play in a day? So, we need to find out how long he plays in total. So, what do we need to do? We need to simply need to add two duration together, right? So, we need to add 1 hour 30 minutes and 45 minutes together to find out how long he plays in total. We just have to add the two duration together. Yes? So, 1 hour 30 minutes plus 45 minutes gives 1 hour 30 minutes plus 45 minutes is 2 hours 15 minutes. So, Aditya plays for total of 2 hours and 15 minutes in a day. Look at one more question here. Here Mr. Sharma takes 1 hour 10 minutes to reach his office daily. If he goes to office 6 days in a day, day, week, how many hours does he spend going to his office in a month of February that to in a leap year? How many days will be there in a leap year? Yes, there will be 28 days in a leap year. So, in a leap year, the month of February has 28 days. If Mr. Sharma goes to the office 6 days a week and it takes him 1 hour 10 minutes to reach the office each day, we can calculate his total travel time for the month of February as follows. So here, travel time per day is 1 hour 10 minutes which is equal to 70 minutes. Correct? So, number of days in February are 28. Number of days in February are 28. So, we need to, what do we need to find here? We need to find the total tra travel time for February. So, to find that, what we have to do is, we have to multiply travel time per day and number of days in February. That is 70 minutes into 28 days. Here, travel time for February equals travel time per day into number of days in February. Travel time per day is 70 minutes. Number of days in February is 28. So, if we multiply 70 into 28, we will be able to find out the total travel time for February. So, 70 minutes per day into 28 days will be 1960 minutes. So, if you have to convert this into minutes and hours, we need to divide it by 60 because 1 hour equals 60 minutes. So, when we convert 1690 by 60, we will get the answer as 32 hours and 40 minutes. So, in a month of February, in an only year, Mr. Sharma spends a total of 32 hours and 40 minutes going to office. So, students, hope these two questions were useful to understand about time duration. Thanks for watching and keep supporting for more such videos. 